So the exhibition uh, today is Doctors, Dissection and Resurrection Men and the basis of that was from archaeological material that was excavated in 2006 from the Royal London Hospital in Whitechapel and amongst it individuals that had indications of post-mortem cuts, dissection, use for teaching and comparative anatomy with uh, animals. Surgeon anatomists at this time were quite socially aspiring and so really to be associated with people like resurrection men wasn't something they particularly wanted to, to do. However, to improve your skills and hone your ability for teaching other people to treat patients, you needed bodies. And so the resurrection men were the means of supplying bodies to the surgeon anatomists. At this period of time, sort of in the early 19th century, life was very hard. Uh, surgery at this time would have been a very brutal affair. There wasn't any um, anaesthesia at this point and uh, times would have been difficult and so hopefully this sort of was reflected in, in the exhibition that it was a time of great strides in learning from anatomy and different practices in, in surgery. My favourite exhibit, there's a lot to choose from, is a wonderful wood pulp uh, model skeleton that a wonderful gentleman called Joseph Town made and uh, he was a, a modeler that was at Guy's Hospital and made some absolutely phenomenal wax models over a 50-year career, but I particularly like his uh, first model.